Brian, how are you, brother? Good. Good, good, man. Thanks for coming out today. Hey, no problem. Tell me uh, what kind of what you're bringing here. This is my 1970 AMC AMX that I bought in the fall of 1987. Have you always been an AMX fan? Well, I heard about this car in uh, high school. A friend of mine knew where it was at. And I bought it right after high school. It's an original 390 car? Yes. And is it all original? I had to locate the engine. It, somewhere through the lines, uh, the engine disappeared, and I had to locate a 390 for it. Okay. But, uh, yeah, it's an original 390 engine now. Period correct or whatever, but yes. it's just not a numbers matching. Right. Right. AMC Oops. didn't have a numbers matching program, but it is a 70 block and intake and heads. Are these stripes or decals? Or Those are, are decal. Yeah. yeah, reproduction decal. Man, look at that interior, dude. That's clean, man. Did you do all the work yourself? A lot of it, all but the, the paint and body work. And, uh, the body was pretty solid when I started. So. All right. Wow. What is it about the AMX that you always like? I think they're cool it, cars. Uh, I have a hard time walking by one, <laughs> to be honest with you. It's different, right? You know, all, these, all my friends in high school, they had the Camaros and the Mustangs, and uh, say, oh, I want something a little different. All right. So, in my area, there was only a couple of these around, and you've sure. already ever seen them. So. Right. That just intrigued me. Yeah. And the more I dug into it, the more I found out they're really rare. I thought I had something there, so I right. thought I'd hold right. on to right. it. Right. Right. Yeah, there's that. less and less of them yeah. all the time. I don't know how many they made in the beginning, but it, it wasn't a ton of them. And they're just really cool cars, the fast back of it. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I have a hard time walking by one. When I see one, um, I always want to shoot it if it's a nice one. And hey, it's credit to you all. There's a lot of nice AMXs out there. When you do yeah. find one, there, is, there seems to be a pretty right. good crop of, uh, of nice ones out there. They're starting to come about again. It's a four speed? It's four speed, yeah. factory four speed. With air condition? Air shifter. No air, this car just had power steering, power brakes from the factory. Did you redo the interior? Yes, yeah, got new seat covers and new carpet. Well, this, this car was restored 20 years ago, so it's starting to show some age. This is a 20 year restoration? Yes. Holy this smokes, was, this man. This was done. I parked it in the fall of 89 and put it back on the road in 1992. No kidding. Can you show me under the hood? Sure. Yeah, that's very nice. He even put the sticker back there. Yep, there you are. When I done this car, they didn't have the internet totally up and going yet, right. and eBay and all that. Right. So I was having to travel to Columbus and hit some big swap meets to get reproduction parts. That's kind of tough too because they made such a limited number of them yeah. that you know there's not a bunch of companies that make like a Camaro or a Firebird Correct. reproduction parts and all. As the years go by here more and more parts are coming out right uh, being remanufactured. I think it would be cool if uh, like Dynacore or something made a repop body on them you know what I'm oh, saying because yeah. they're cool cars. Full, you know? full quarter panels. I mean we don't need American Motors to come back we, <laughs> we, just, we just need this one model of American right. Motors you know. Because this is one of the, they had a couple other cool things out there, um, but yeah, no. I searched for 10 years to find that air cleaner. No kidding. I had an air cleaner off of a 71 Kyle induction, and with the internet, I put an ad out there, hey, I'll trade this air cleaner for the one I need. Within the same day, a guy emailed me back from Alberta, Canada. Wow. Uh, he said, I got what you need, I'll trade you even up. How cool is so, that? My brother, that's a nice car, man. Like I said, when I pulled you, when I saw you pull in, I was talking to somebody and I said, I gotta go. I'll be right <laughs> back. So, no, I'm glad you brought it out here. Anything else you wanna tell me about it? Uh, it's just, it's been a fun car. Anybody we need to give a shout out that maybe helped you do some work on it? Uh, it'd be uh, Leroy Blessing okay. and his son uh, Lonnie. Right. They've done the body and paint for me and done a fabulous job. Dude, if, it, uh, if it's lasted 20 years, they've done more than a fabulous job for you. I don't even know what products you'd use. We kid people that painted in a hog barn. No it kidding. Was, it's what it was, an old barn con paint, converted into a uh, paint booth. Wow. They did good work, used obviously good products. Yeah. But again, they got the body right before they did it. That's a big yep. help. That's they the big what thing they were doing, right? The black, you right, know, right, right, right. Um, just the black and the red really, really sets it off. I you see a lot of red ones. There's another red one here, actually, and, yes. I, and I'm unsure if I've shot that one or if it's a different one. But it seems like that's what I'm have. That's the only thing I'm having any luck finding is a red one. And I'm a, a black guy myself. I like I had, the black. Yeah, so. I've seen your Mustang. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I was like, when, like I said, when I pulled in, I saw this come down the driveway. Even though it was raining, I was like, nah, I better look at that AMX. Brother, I appreciate you coming out. Well, thank you. Thanks so much.